Okay, in this video I'm going to be going over how you can find pretty much any function or symbol on your TI-84+. Plus. So normally you might press a key like the math key to bring up a number of categorized lists of functions that you can type into your calculator. Or if you were in the middle of programming something, for example, um, from the programming window, if you press the program key, this will bring up another menu full of programming functions that you might want to use and they're all sort of categorized based on their function but if you just want a complete list of all the functions or characters that you can type into your calculator um, you can press second zero for catalog and that'll bring up the catalog menu and then from here you get this very long list which you can scroll through using the directional pad or what's quite a bit faster is just jumping to the place in the list based on the first letter of the function that you want. Um, so if you know, for example, that your function starts with an L, uh, you can press the key corresponding to whatever letter you want. So I'll press this close parentheses key um, for L, and that'll jump me to L in the list. And the alpha key will stay selected while you're in this list by default. So if you want to jump anywhere else, um, you can just keep pressing the keys that correspond to the letter you want, so D, E, F, G, etc. And then that'll just jump you to the section in the list, and then from there you can use the arrow keys to select exactly what function you want. And if you want uh, some sort of special character, those are in this list, and the fastest way to get to it is just to start from the top at A, and then just press up on the directional pad, which will take you to the bottom of the list. And this is where all the special characters are for your calculator, so if you want one of those, you just keep scrolling up, and then when you find the one you want, you can just press enter, and it will input it to wherever your cursor was previously. So hopefully this was helpful, and thanks for watching.